Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back Joe Reagan and Suzanne Sitherwood. Wow, you heard from two mayors tonight. I'm not sure which one blew us away more. I think Rosa's lit up that stage. But I gotta tell you, what Mayor Slay said really will light up the future. And it was really important to see Mayor Slay there with our other regional leaders that know what he, is, he has done, but also with leading this region forward, County Executive Stenger, Madison County Chairman Alan Dunstan, County Executive Elman. It's true, yes, I think they deserve to serve in public life today and to, um, to, to take the risks they have to do deserves our support. But you know what, we're gonna change things up a little bit now. In a moment, we'd uh, like to bring out a very special guest. That would be chairman and co-founder of Worldwide Technology. David Stewart knows quite a bit about developing and attracting talent. Worldwide Technology provides technology and supply chain solutions to thousands of companies across the globe and employs more than 3,000 people in more than 20 facilities throughout the world, which will soon include their new headquarters being built in Maryland Heights. The company has been consistently recognized by Fortune Magazine on their 100 best places to work list. Beyond Worldwide's own workforce development, David is passionately committed to fostering an educated and competitive workforce by increasing the number of diverse college graduates and professionals who are prepared to fulfill jobs in the science, technology, engineering, and math-related industries. To help accomplish this, David is here tonight to announce the launch of an initiative called the Global Leadership Forum right here from St. Louis. He is a community leader, a mentor, an entrepreneur, an author, a catalyst, and now one of the advisory board members of this new initiative to create a national pipeline of diverse STEM talent to meet the demands of our economy. Please welcome David Stewart. 